everyone, Silas Q here. So today I'm going to show you guys all the products or items I've been loving in the month of June. So if you guys do love these type of videos where I just share with you everything that I love in a month, please let me know by liking this video or commenting down below and letting me know so I can continue to do these favorites video for every month from now on. Let's just get right into the favorites video. My first item that I've been loving is this bad boy. And this is my hot iron holster. And what this item does is basically if you're curling your hair, straightening your hair, whatever hot tool you're using, you can just put it inside and leave it. It cools off, you don't burn your countertop or your dresser top, whatever. I used to like burn the heck out of my dresser by just like doing my hair and then I'll put it and then sometimes forget. And then <laughs> that I'm doing my hair, yeah, I'll forget that I'm doing my hair. I'll go to put on lipstick or whatever, and I will totally forgot that I have a hot tool on and it would burn my countertop. So this saves me from that. And these come in a bunch of different colors. There's like purple, pink, blue, um, yeah, but I chose the white one because I just, I don't know, I just like white items. I think it would go perfect with everything, like, you know, like your table, your walls, whatever. I'm babbling, I'm sorry, but I really, really, really love this. In case you're interested in getting a white one like I did, they're so easy to clean. All you have to do is clean it with a um, cotton ball or cotton wipe, whatever wipe, and dip it in nail polish remover and you can clean the white one really easily like that. This is like my favorite product out of everything here I have to show you because it just saves me so much trouble from having to get new dressers or, you know, clumsiness of just burning everything inside that I would put my hot tool on. Moving on, I've been loving the Butter Lipstick by NYX and it's in the color BLS09 and it's called Candy Buttons. The color that is shown from the tube is a brighter pink compared to what it looks like when on the lips. The texture is creamy and allows the product to glide on really easily. This lipstick is so moisturized and after you apply it on your lips, your lips will be set for like a good few hours and it'll feel so soft and won't dry up. It does have a subtle shine to it, but I think it's perfect because it's not totally matte and it does have a little bit of frostiness. I love the shade. I think that it goes with any makeup look because it's not a bright pink, but it's not too muted out where it's a nude so it's a perfect color between a nude and a pink so it's the perfect nude pink if that makes any sense what I like to pair with my NYX lipstick is the NK lip pencil in the color A19 nude love how it goes together. I think it blends together really nicely on my lips. So yes, I've been loving those two together. Next, let's talk about mascara. I've been loving the Artistry Mascara. I just wanted to quickly show you the difference the mascara makes. The right eye has and the left eye doesn't. What I love about this mascara is that I feel like when I put it on, I'm not even wearing mascara. It does the job it's supposed to. It makes your lashes look really long and thick but natural. I feel like it fans out my lashes perfectly because the brush, well the wand, it just works really great with the product. The product isn't heavy or thick so it doesn't weigh down my lashes. It just sticks naturally to the brush and it applies really easily. What I usually do is I pair the Artistry Mascara with my Revlon Bold Lacquer by Grow Luscious. This is how it looks like. And I just love the Revlon to go on top of the Artistry Mascara because I feel like the Artistry Mascara is more of a really good base. 
and the Revlon gives way more volume, way more thickness than the Artistry. So when you put it together, I think it's an amazing combination. So I've been loving that this month. I've been pairing it together ever since I got the Revlon from Beautycon. And it's called Saved by the Blue, and it's like a true blue. It's in your face. It's gorgeous. That's my opinion of it. I really, really love to wear this because it's perfect for the summertime. I think that it just stands out. And if you're wearing a really plain outfit, your focus will be on your nails because how can it not with this beautiful blue? I don't know where you live, but where I am right now, it's super hot and sunny. So I definitely need to protect my eyes with sunglasses. And I've been gravitating to these. For like the whole month of June. So I thought I'd include it in my favorites video. fits me pretty decently compared to other glasses I've tried on so I've really been loving that now let's talk about hats because like I said where I live it's super hot and super sunny so I need the Sun out of my face and not blazing on my head so I've been loving this I think it's the perfect floppy hat where even if your hair is bad or <laughs> you have dandruff or oily hair, whatever your hair excuse is, I think it covers everything perfectly. So yeah, I've really been loving sun hats or any hats basically, but this is the hat I've been gravitating towards mostly this month with cute little sun dresses and all that jazz. My next item is a clothing piece and I've really been loving this Adriana Papel um, cardigan, kimono, I don't know what you want to call it, but I know that these pieces have been trending all this summer. And what I love about this is not, it's just, it's not a typical cardigan or kimono where it's flowers. I love that it's in your face, but not too much because of the detail and of the embroidery. outfit so you can wear the most boring thing and this will make it look amazing okay everyone those are all the items or products I had to share with you guys that I've really been loving in the month of June um like I said before if you do enjoy videos where I share with you guys whatever I love for the month please let me know by liking this video or commenting down below so next month I can have more stuff to show you guys um, to see more of my videos, please subscribe. Until then, I'll see you later. Bye!